As a teenager, Elizabeth Smart was kidnapped and repeatedly raped. Now as an adult, she says she was sexually assaulted again, this time on an airplane while flying home to Utah last summer. Smart says she was asleep when the man next to her started touching her inappropriately, rubbing his hand on her inner thigh. Seriously? Again? Like, can this really be happening to me? Again. Do I have a big sign across my forehead that says, victim? I mean, how is this happening to me again? Smart says she filed a complaint with Delta, does not blame the airline. In a statement, Delta says, we took the matter seriously and have continued to cooperate with Ms. Smart and the appropriate authorities. Smart says she also spoke with the FBI and the investigation is ongoing. The FBI says it can't confirm or deny an investigation. According to the federal government, sexual assaults on flights are rising at an alarming rate, up 66% over a three-year period. Smart says after what happened last summer, she decided to create a self-defense program in Utah for women and girls. She calls it Smart Defense. She first made headlines in 2002, when at the age of 14, Smart was abducted at knife point from her bedroom. Elizabeth, if you're out there, we're doing everything we possibly can to help you. She was held captive for nine months before she was rescued. Since then, Smart has been an advocate for missing persons and victims of sexual abuse, responsibility that for her remains as important as ever. Joe Fryer, NBC News. Hey, NBC News fans, thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Subscribe by clicking on that button down here and click on any of the videos over here to watch the latest interviews, show highlights, and digital exclusives. Thanks for watching.